right, budget magic time. Playing some more Mono Blue Colossus in Modern, and good lord, that is three Lodestone Golems. All right, so our plan, I think, here is we're on the play, so I think we can keep this hand, ideally condescend our opponent's first play, scry into lands, and just play three Lodestone Golems in a row. And hopefully that's enough to win us the game. Opponent, ooh. Island, oh, it's Merfolk. Okay. Uh, that makes things a bit sketchy. Darksteel Citadel, go. Another island. Silvergill, Revealing Curse Catcher. Well, we gotta try it. Our opponent's gonna set Curse Catcher, I'm sure. Yep. Draws a card. Uh, this might be a miserable matchup with the whole island walk issue. Well, Thirst for Knowledge is not a horrible draw. Maybe we just main phase it. Thirst, discard an artifact, Lodestone Golem, and pass the turn. Another island for our opponent. And there's a Rejury. Opponent gets in for three. So, island... I mean, I think our best bet is just to play a Lodestone Golem and pass. This isn't a great plan, but it does make it harder for our opponent to just combo off with Meryl Rejury. Play as a Lord of Atlantis. Yeah, we're going to need a good draw, though, because our opponent's stuff all has Island Walk now. And there's the Curse Catcher. Untaps land for no reason. Yeah, this is going to be a challenging matchup. Gets in for seven. So we literally have to draw something this turn or we're just dead. Oh no, there's All His Dust too. All His Dust is a card that could do it, but we don't have enough mana, so. All right. Well, good draw, Merfolk. Like I said, this feels like a very challenging matchup. So we can bring in Ratchet Bomb. We can bring in Spatial Contortions and bring in Dismembers. I think that's our best bet, just to try to kill our opponent's stuff. Go down the Stoic Rebuttals. Go down a Padim seems pretty slow. Maybe a Treasure Mage, a Lodestone, and a Condescend. And just try it like that. Yeah, I do not have a lot of hope that we're going to beat Merfolk with this deck. Alright, we get to play first. I mean, we could, we just need a really good draw. We'll try this. No colorless mana is a little sketchy. Uh, so Island Goo. So hopefully we draw... I mean, the good news is we got a bunch of colorless lands, and we got artifacts that make colorless mana. All right, there's a colorless land. That's good. So Darksteel, Citadel, go. This is a draw that could maybe beat Merfolk. They don't have an Aether Vial, and we can just kind of kill their plays. Opponent passes. All right, Island Go. Another Island. Plays Silvergill, revealing Lord of Atlantis. Well, let's just kill Silvergill. Opponent draws a card. Island and... Hedron Archive? Oh, dear. Opponent does have a Spell Pierce. Okay. Well, that didn't work out how we were hoping. Another land for our opponent. Plays a Lord of Atlantis. And gets in with the Mutavault. 4-3. So we're down to 17. Now let's see what we draw. Academy Ruins. Well, you could get back Hedron Archive. Let's just kill Lord of Atlantis. Pass the turn. Leave up, condescend, also leave up the ability to get back Hedron Archive if we really want to. Another Muta Vault. There's a Master of the Pearl Trident. Well, I think we gotta condescend just to tap our opponent out. They can pay, but they can't attack with Muta Vault. And we get to scry. So opponent pays, gets a Master. Hopefully we draw into more removal. Alright, that works. Um... Put on top, put on top. So kill the master.
Pass the turn. Extra land there would have been decent, but... What else does our opponent have? More lords? Oh yeah, more lords. Well, we put up a good fight, but this looks like it's the end. We killed a lot of our opponent's stuff. Unfortunately, they had an extremely land and lord heavy draw, which is very hard for us to compete with. Uh, the biggest problem is... Hedron Archive, go. The biggest problem here is just the island walk. It's really hard for us to do much about our opponent's island walking abilities. Mutavault, another Mutavault. And because they're attacking with lands, it's not like removal even really helps us. So we take eight. Yeah, this is just a very miserable matchup. We even drew the all is dust, but it doesn't matter because our opponent drew three Mutavaults. Yeah, I mean, that's a bad matchup either way, and our opponent's draw was just super good against our deck, so, eh.